now transform into an anxiety, but as every mother knows, the excited play of children often enough culminates in quarreled in tears. I have therefore good reasons for rejecting the explanation that is the state of our uh, general sensation during sleep, the sensation of our movements. Uh, one that involves dreams of flying and falling, I see that this very sensation have been reproduced from the memory to which to the dream refers, and that they are therefore dream content and nor dream source. I do not uh, for a moment deny, however, I am unable to finish a full explanation of the series of typical dreams. Precisely here my material slips me in harsh. I must adhere to the general opinion that all general and kinetic sensation of these typical dreams are awakened at the soul, as any psychic motive for whatever kind has need of them, as that they are neglected when there is no much need of them. The relation to that experience seems to be confirmed by indications which I have obtained from an else like on the road, but I am unable to say what other means might in the course of dreamer's life have become attached to the memory of sensation, perhaps in each individual, despite typical appearance of the dreams, and I should uh, much to be in position to fill the gap with careful and else a good example to those who wonder why I complain lack of material despite the frequency of the dreams of flying for into the story. I must explain that I myself have never experienced any such dreams since I have turned my attention to the subject of dream interpretation. The dream of neurotics which are at my disposal, however, are not capable of interpretation, and often it's possible to penetrate the father's voice and uh, the hidden intention and certain psychic force which participated in the building of neurosis and which again becomes active during the solution or post-interpretation of the final problem. Repetitory post